Hi, I'm Yaniv Levy, the owner of Cuban Stock Cigar Company. Today I'd like to explain what's the difference between a long filler cigar, premium cigar, to a short filler cigar, and the tremendous difference in quality and in price. Cigar made with long leaves cut right from the tobacco plant. They get dry for anywhere between three years to five years. Come to the roller's table and the roller pretty much bunch in average of five leaves together and you put it in a binder, get the cigar with a wrapper. And the leaves are probably in the length there of uh, between six to eight and nine inches. The cigar then cut to the desirable size. The roller cuts and there is a piece of anywhere. The shorter piece would that fall is an inch up to two inch long that fall to the side of the table. At the end of the day, all these pieces are get collected and these pieces are very valuable. Premium cigar, as uh, I'll take an example, the Cuban Stock Royal Selection. It's a five years old tobacco that aged in oak barrels for a minimum of three years, 100% Cuban seeds. Average cost of a pound is between uh, $10 to uh, $28. Those short pieces that fall are very, very valuable. And the Cuban Stock Cigar Company, for example, like to keep those pieces and not sell them. And making the famous Everyday Joe short filler cigars with a super premium tobacco. This short filler cigar would sell for anywhere between $1.50 to $3. And it has a super premium tobacco, but it's a short filler cigar. I will show you closely the difference in long filler and a short filler and I will explain the constructive uh, difference and in, in smoke and quality and cost. I'm going to op open up a long filler cigar and show you how a cigar, a long filler cigar made and what's hold it all together. When smoking a long filler cigar, you have a very good chance for a long ash. The long filler tobacco holds it all in one. The long filler is uses and act like a spine. So when the cigar is burned, you have a good consistent flavor. There are long leaves. And this is a Lijero, it's a little darker. But here we have a long leaves, a good premium cigar. A short filler cigar. It's a wrapper. There is a binder. short pieces it's a short filler cigar and a spine in the center to hold it together there's very small likelihood that the cigar will hold ash cigars would burn the cigar would smoke the cigar would more likely taste very good but it will not be as elegant and it's definitely not in a, any good standard of a 100% long filler handmade cigar. You would pay a lot less and nothing wrong if it's made by, and I repeat, if it's made by a reputable company that uses a good short tobacco 
from their premium line of cigars you will enjoy a good tasty cigar for a very little bit of money.